Well guys, it looks like we officially got Ellen out of here. I dropped this video a couple days ago and boom, Ellen announces her wanting out of The Ellen Show. Along with a very passive aggressive post, where she pretty much took absolutely no accountability for all the terrible things people said about her and how she treats others. The note was basically, well my company was good but then it got too big and I couldn't monitor what everyone was doing so not everyone chose to act appropriately. By the way, none of this was my fault. And this was a really weird thing to say because a lot of the workplace complaints have been about producers and executives on her set. People who Ellen probably interacts with and talks to on a daily basis. So she threw them under the bus and then she played the whole I'm a nice gay woman card once again. How many lies have you told Pinocchio? Well anyways, now that the whole world knows and agrees that Ellen is terrible, I wanted to make a list of people who could possibly replace Ellen DeGeneres on her own show. For one, I'm throwing my hat into the ring. All my fans said that we needed the Jamari show. Screw Ellen. It's my time, man. Other than that, we have The Rock, Eric Andre, Tyler the Creator. How about the Jersey Girl? Anthony Fantano, Dax Flame, Eva Longoria, Salma Hayek, Betty White, Kanye, Bernie, My Dog Delilah, Logic, Will Smith, Kevin Hart, Joe Rogan, Tiger Belly, Skippy, The Geico Lizard, Mr. Miyagi, 50 Cent, and there's so many more and I bet we could all think of around 100 people who could replace Ellen. It's like we finally saw behind the curtains like in Wizard of Oz and everyone's finally seeing behind the mystique, everyone's finally seeing who Ellen truly is. Now if Ellen does try and indeed come back, we will see if she can survive. I do think she has enough brainwashed followers where she could be alright. I'm sure she'll come on the Ellen stage, it'll get real quiet, and then she'll say something like, Well, I'm sure it's been no secret that there's some pretty serious allegations surrounding the show and my studio here at the Ellen Show. I just want you guys to know that we do not tolerate that type of behavior and the appropriate actions and the appropriate firings have taken place. We want everyone here to feel like the Ellen experience is one of inclusion, a safe space for both employees and viewers alike. Like I always say, be kind to one another. She says all this all while she pimp slaps the new intern of the day for showing up two minutes late with her coffee. She slapped the door guy on her way out because he didn't have a piece of gum in his mouth. In my opinion, I think the old gal should really just hang up the mic, stick a fork in her, it's over. During her career, she made millions, she won many awards, but you know it must sting to know that you were loved for your entire career and then at the very end, it all crashed and burned just like the thousands of worthless bridges Ellen seems to have burned herself. You go sit in that Ellen jail over there right now. <laughs> So I was watching her accept an award for achievement in television last year with the Global Globe Awards and she basically went up there and did some stand-up which was horrible. And out of the whole thing I just thought it was very ironic that she said this. I feel like you've all really gotten to know me over the past 17 years. I am an open book. No. I don't even know how she got this many chances. Before The Ellen Show, she had two cracks at a TV sitcom that both failed miserably. So you know the elites up there really wanted Ellen to get on. And like I said before, if Ellen has any smarts at all, she's gonna try and get out of here before things get worse and worse and more stuff comes to light because I have a feeling that being rude is just kind of the tip of the iceberg compared to how evil Ellen can truly be. Like I said, I really do not trust this woman. We'll see what type of information comes out next. As always, I want to thank you guys for watching the video. Thank you for subscribing today. It means the world to me when you share the videos with your friends. But as y'all know, it's your boy the Tan Superman. There's someone else out here who needs to get destroyed. I'm coming for you, Ellen. Peace, guys.